Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is a weekly general collective tarot reading session for you Scorpio. This reading for today is for the Scorpio friends out there, okay? Thank you Scorpio for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guess viewers, if you haven't, click the subscribe button and the bell. Please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, Scorpio, you know what to do. All of the details about me, my channel, myself, and my team is down the description box below, okay? This is a weekly general collective reading. There's still going to be an exclusive love reading for you for this week. Um, it is going to be uploaded in the next one, two days, next 24 hours, okay? So click the bell, click subscribe, so you are notified whenever I upload the love reading. Okay, this is general collective. If there's a love energy here, I'll let you know. Okay, all right, Scorpio, let's start the reading. You've got the Page of Swords. This is a messenger. I feel like this week there is some sort of a, you know, breakup or separation or not so good news because this is Two of Cups. You know, they don't want to deliver this. I feel like it was necessary to say this or to find out something. And it's about a love reading. Queen of Wands. Something tells me, but something tells me that you're doing something like it's a real, it's something because I mean, look at the Queen of Wands. I mean, this is definitely you, Scorpio. You've got this smirk on your face. You're doing something naughty, Scorpio. I feel it. I know it. Something this week tells me that there's a message. It's about a breakup or it's about like goodbye or letting go, you know, two of cups in reverse. But actually, there's a counter offer or there's a, some sort of, I don't know, obviously, like you're winning. Like something tells me in here that something looks like and feels like it's going or it's a breakup. But there's a twist of, uh, there's a sudden, something tells me that that's not the outcome. Although it's look, it is looking like it's a separation, it's a breakup or it, it looks like, you know, I'm not agreeing. It, it's a feeling where I'm not, I'm breaking up because I want to get something. Like, I'm doing this because I want to trigger something. I'm, I'm look at the Queen of you know, Queen of Wands like that. You know, it's, there's a darkness in her. Look at that. Look at the cat. This Queen of Wands is protected by her intuition. The cat. The, um, the familiar. Yeah, you are familiar for whatever it is that you're doing. You have... You have a you have something potential. You're cooking something, Scorpio. Yeah, you do. Let's see. Yeah. It could be a breakup, a separation, or you could be unloading a huge amount of energy or feelings. Okay? Like you're provoking. Like, hey, hey, hey. So, yeah. Not swords. You're giving them a headache, a problem. Four of cups. I don't think this is you. I think this is them, Scorpio. You are giving someone a hard time. You're giving someone something a hard time in terms of convincing. Because you're the queen in this reading. You're definitely the queen of wands. The person, the situation that you're dealing with. They're, uh, they're having a hard time moving on, unloading. They don't know. Like they... This is not ideal for them. In this reading, if this was a breakup or a separation, you will survive. Your person is not. Like, look at them, four of cups. I'm dehydrated. I'm not eating. I'm not sleeping. I am not wanting to go to work. I'm not taking a bath. <laughs> I'm just going to sleep here. So, there is something that you're involved with, Scorpio. I think for some of you, it's just about to happen. But this is... This is something of a meant to be to happen. Like, it could be a breakup, a separation. I don't know. It could be a divorce, but you don't care. Like, you're so ready for it. I feel like you're willing. I feel like in this reading, you are so ready to lose someone. But they're not so ready to lose you. Yeah. Okay, this is a jumper. Six of swords. You're telling the person to go away. Like, you know, you could be pregnant. There's an empress card in here, but... 
something tells me that you want to be the queen of wands you want to be alone you want to you want to get rid of something something that makes you nine of swords four of cups like you want to be yeah you want something you want something like you you want a king you don't like you I mean you like the person but you don't like what they're giving to you so you're giving back like you're giving me a problem i'm gonna give that back to you like someone is you know it's in this reading someone is giving you a headache some something someone is giving you some sort of a complicated someone puts you in a complicated situation you don't sit in a complicated situa situation you you know you get rid of it you know in in this reading six of swords you know like someone puts you in a very difficult or complicated situation or someone puts you in a problematic like someone puts you in a situation where it's in their advantage and it is your disadvantage you don't they can't do that to you queen of wands you know you you will take the power you will you're taking your power back if someone gives you a problem you give them twice that problem okay so you know whoever this person is or this situation is the most important thing in here is you like you're not you know when you get to a point that you don't have fear to lose the person or the situation that makes you happy then you are really liberated liberating it means your happiness is you i mean how no matter how important this person or this situation is you don't fear losing them they fear losing you and of swords four of cups it will proceed you know king of swords in reverse Six of Swords, King of Swords in reverse. Something will proceed. A goodbye, a breakup, a separation. But your smirk, your face is lit with a separation or disconnection or a breakup. Or maybe this is you moving houses or you moving a new job. But something tells me that you are prepared for this. Like game on. Like someone challenged you. Game on. Okay. Someone is feeling sick or dehydrated this week. And it's connected to that issue or problem. Yeah. King and queen. Someone is making an excuse. I feel like you, Scorpio, are also playing the game. For some of you, there is a situation that they want to delay it. And you're allowing the delay. Because you know that they are they are having drama. So, for example, you we're going through a breakup. Okay, we're breaking up. We're breaking up. But um, can we do it tomorrow because I'm not feeling well? Or this or that. Something tells me there is a delay in moving, whether it's physical or it's emotional, but there is a delay in doing this. There's a separation, there's a breakup, there's a goodbye in here, but someone is delaying it. And I think you're giving them, like you're allowing it to get delayed. Like you've got a plan, like look at you, like the queen of wands. This, you have this smirk on your face, like, <laughs> I know what you're doing. I mean, in this reading, if the person or the situation feels like they're fooling you, they're, no, <laughs> you are playing the game smartly, intuitively, and you're full of energy. Look at that. Look at that. You want something, Scorpio. You want something in here. You want something for yourself. You want justice. You are going to leave a person or a situation because they gave you injustice so if someone gives you problem you don't give them a problem you give them a solution the solution is you are a problem i'll say goodbye to you okay if you are the cause of the problem then i'll say goodbye to you i will not solve the problem i'll just get rid of you you know Queen of Wands. That is justice for me. Your justice system is different. Your justice system is something you created. Justice, yeah. Justice to an injustice situation. Yeah. This person or situation caused you problem. You did not solve the problem. You just got rid of them. Yeah. Okay, you lover, give me problem. 
I don't have time to solve that. I get rid of you, then I don't have a problem. You know, that's that's my justice system. Like, this is you. Well, you know, that's my justice system, yeah. King and queen. I think they're aware of that. You're also dealing with a person who will be, will pick up intuitively that you've got some game. You've got the zing. Like, you've got this flair. Ambition. Ambitious. You've got this strong drive. But the way you drive this out is to get results. If it doesn't exactly way exactly work the way you want it to be, so be it. Yeah, very powerful. Yeah, magician card. All or nothing. Like if you blink, you lose. You, you might be pregnant. Seven of Cups. Yeah, there is an alas. Okay, I feel like there's a collateral damage. There's an alas. Something tells me that you won't complete you won't be able to completely let go of this okay i feel like this is i don't know it could be a job but something tells me that you will not be able to completely let go of this or let go of you completely there would be a series of back and forth okay could be a negotiation but there's a series of back and forth between the two of you i feel like you're prepared to let go I feel like somehow the person is also prepared to let go. There is a little bit of manipulation in the beginning. But as you settle down, like when the separation or the movement really happens, there would be, like it will make sense. There would be some sort of negotiation after this. Because you wouldn't know until you do it, until you separate or break up or until you move in that apartment or until you move in that job, until you go there. And leave this like, until you go to point B and leave point A where the problem is. You you won't really know the the scenario, like how it's gonna play up until you do it. So when this the situation play up, when days and weeks is running, you know I see it a turnaround, a, a negotiation. Yeah, I'm seeing the five of swords in reverse in the pre shuffle when I said that. Yeah, change of mind. I can't do it, Scorpio. Look at that. Can't do it. Yeah. Um, they were blindsided. Okay, whoever you're dealing with, Scorpio, it's pretty, 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 pretty Scorpio, please. Don't you ever, ever, ever. What's that song? Dun, 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 dun. They were blindsided. I don't know what are you doing, Scorpio, but this is like an ending for you to have a beginning. Or this is you um, shedding. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting like something in here has to end. Saying goodbye. Leaving, leaving a person or situation or job or a location. But something tells me it's just a goodbye in here. Or moving on or moving forward. And I feel like the person will agree. And you would have, like, it's an experimental stage, but it would go on. And Two of Swords, the experience, the experimentation of breaking or separation, or maybe doing that role, to this role, you know, because it's just collective reading. But it could also be love where, okay, I'll try this. Okay, challenge me. Okay, I'll go there. I, I'll shout there. <laughs> okay, this is, you know, okay, I'll try. Okay, Scorpio, you want me to do this? I'll do this. Challenge accepted. And they did. They experimented. You experimented. Okay? You know. You're intuitive of the outcome. You know them better than they know themselves. You know, for some of you guys. Um, experimental. So this is the aftermath of the experiment. To absorb Ace of Wands. I can't. I did not like my choice. You know. They were blindsided of their choice. The choice is not you, Scorpio. The choice is not you. And they were blindsided with that. The blind spot. Let's see. I feel like it's a love reading. Although I'm trying to pick up. It's more of a relationship reading where they did not support you. They did not approve you. They were not on your side. And you let them be. You let them go. Weeks or days or weeks passed. And you are totally right. You know, at the end you win. The winner takes it all. Hmm. Hmm.
Three of Pentacles. Five of Swords. There is a reality after this, Scorpio. Be prepared. Two cards. Outcome and wise. Yeah. Mm -hmm -hmm. I feel like there's no winner. It's a stalemate. Because you also lose them or they lose you. It's a stalemate. You know, but there was some honesty. I feel like the situation, it's bottom of the deck, it's, it was a hangman. Yeah, this is reverse. Yeah, I feel like there's no winner in this situation. You might have feel like you've played the game or you might feel like, you might have feel like you've, you've won because they made a mistake, but I don't think they could just turn around so quickly or reverse it back. They do, they want it. In fact, in fact, this person's like blindsided. But I feel like they could not just turn it back. You know, Seven of Pentacles. There's already some repercussion. I feel like it's a stalemate. You lose them, they lose you. You lose each other. There's no winner, a stalemate. Although I feel like you're having fun doing it. They did not. In here, you look like you're the winner because you handle it well. You're smiling. They're, they're struggling. But I feel like it's a stalemate. Last card. Yeah, they still would like to keep you. Okay, one more. This card wanted to come out. Yeah. Even though it's a missed opportunity, they're still struggling to let you go. Yeah. There you go. Then you become a king of wands. Remember, in the beginning, I was like, you want them to be a king of wands. This is like a process where you have to set, the, you know, like you have to set someone free for them to grow courage, for them to core to grow a heart <laughs> you know it's 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 a very very spot on reading where you have do not fear letting go letting go gives you an opportunity and answer in here you don't fear it you enjoy it okay and there was there's gonna be a part of this i don't think it's gonna happen overnight but there's gonna be a part of this where somehow you're quite sad they're gone you know but they become this they become the man, the person you want them to be. They become the, the offer, the situation you want to be. You know, they become the match. Yeah. Queen and king. So you've got a match in the making. Match made in heaven. So I'll see you soon, Scorpio, and have a great day. Bye-bye.